Hello, what's up, what's up, what's up? Welcome to my channel, Journey to Soul. My name is Z. What is up, everybody? I am checking in with the beautiful sign of Cancer, okay? Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Anyone with heavy Cancer placements in their chart. I hope all is well with you, Cancer. So please, a like, subscribe, and share if you like the message and it resonates, okay? Cool. I'm um, just going to give you guys a quick intuitive message. I'm going to check in with the current energy, um, especially in regards to following that um, powerful, powerful um, Lion's Gate portal, okay? A new Moon and Leo energy. So yeah, let's just get straight into it. I'm going to pull one oracle um, before we get started. See what the overall energy is for my cancers. All right. Release. So you're in your own energy doing you here. Okay. Uh, gratitude at the bottom of the deck and will at the top of the deck. Okay. So very powerful energy here. All right. I'm definitely feeling like you made it through the portal here. Okay. Um, you could be releasing some baggage, um, some emotions here. All right. Even some pain, resentment here, because I have gratitude at the bottom of the deck. So I like the release and then filling your cup right back up here with love. I just saw 144. So let's just get straight into it. Mm -hmm. Moon card at the top of the deck. Ten of Cups at the bottom of the deck here, okay? All right, I feel like you could be really quiet at this time, okay? We are remaining vigilant here. Uh, you could be dealing with a Leo. Release and gratitude. Let's just get straight into the Tarot Cancer and see what's going on with you guys. All right, Queen of Pentacles here sitting on top of the world. Not worried about a damn thing here. A magician at the top of the deck. Uh -huh. I mean, a magician at the bottom of the deck in the Ace of Wands at the top of the way here. Okay, so, you know, as above, so below here. Okay, manifesting your life, cultivating, I'm hearing, your dreams, aspirations here, and visions. Okay, very powerful time for you right now. All right, I feel like you're definitely filling your time up, okay, with... A lot of inner work, actually. Okay, let's let's see what's going on. Because I feel like you're in this mode of attraction. You could be dealing with a Pisces here. All right? So someone's having some type of sorrowful energy here. And yeah, here's the Ace of Cups. You know, but that could also speak to this release. That could also speak to the release. Because I have the Ace of Cups at the top of the deck with the Magician still at the bottom. All right, so you're in the, in the mode of attracting as you release this sorrowful energy here, okay? Could be even uh, stagnant. I'm hearing weary, okay? All right, two of cups energy. All right, justice. Could be dealing uh, with the Libra, okay? So bringing forth new contracts here. All right, so Eight of Pentacles here uh, with the higher fan. Ooh. Seven of Swords at the top of the deck here. So someone's, I'm hearing the getaway bus, getaway van here with the Seven of Swords. Um, Eight of Pentacles. Someone started some drama, okay? A little fire starter here. Could be dealing with a, a fire sign here. But someone's trying to sneak out, okay, after causing a ruckus here. This could even be at work here um, or at some type of institution, financial institution, okay? Hmm. Let's see what's going on. Could be some lying going on here at your job. Let's see, let's see what's up here, okay? Queen of Wands popping all out here. Yeah, with the Nine of Wands energy, yeah. Okay, a bit of a duel or battle going on let's see see what the hell oh yeah fiery energy so you could be dealing uh with another female here okay could be a taurus um but someone's feeling a little feisty a little froggy let's see what's going on here 
because I'm feeling like you got your guard up um, in regards to this female. You're moving forward here. All right, nine of swords. I'm feeling like somebody is actually could be but hurt in the energy. Let's see, let's see what the hell. Yeah, and you're very well protected here. So again, um, you know, we did hear vitality earlier in the reading. You could be dealing with the Leo, but showcasing a lot of strength here. Okay, with the higher energy at this time and the Empress energy here. So someone could be jealous here. Okay, very jealous here. Mm -hmm. Someone doesn't measure up here. Okay, someone does not compare. To the Empress energy, yeah, and they're going through a damn tower moment here. All right, <laughs> someone's falling, falling, falling into a uh -huh, tower here, into, into a pit here. All right, really fortunate at the top of the deck, and the King of Swords at the bottom. Interesting here. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay. <laughs> Keep wanting to say Pisces. Okay, Cancer. You know, you may have turned your back on a contract here, um, a relationship. And there could be some person that's still attached to you or the situation ship here um, that's feeling some type of way. Okay, three of cups here, ace of cups. So you are celebrating here. I'm feeling someone's definitely in the energy of celebrating with the ace of cups and the three of cups energy. Could be dealing with the water sign. Um, and again, there's just a lot of sorrowful energy in the background here. All right. Seven of Pentacles, Five of Cups, Tower moment. Like I said, you could have been dealing um, with a, another female having an issue with them here. But I just feel like it's all in regards to your victory lap here with the Ace of Cups and the Three of Cups. You could be being celebrated at this time here. Lots of love coming your way, perhaps. Yes. Lots of love coming your way perhaps, or, you know, gratitude. You're loving on yourself here. I just feel like things are definitely going your way here. I'm um, coming full circle. Hmm. Um, you're, attra you're attracting the world to you here, okay? Through your likeness, I'm hearing. Ooh, you're attracting a king of pentacles as well here as a lover, possibly. Ooh, yeah, someone wants a new start, a new beginning, okay? Five of cups. Five of five of cups. <laughs> Again, you know, someone's feeling some type of way. Okay. So five of pentacles with the three of cups and the six of wands energy. Eh. It's giving me third party. Uh, low vibrations here. Yeah, with the lovers could be dealing with the Gemini here. Okay, so a lot coming to light here um, about a third party or about a group or collaboration here. Okay, some exposure here with the sun and... <laughs> Yeah, with the sun and the high priestess energy here, someone perhaps wants to apologize, okay, for their hmm, magician ways here, for their shady ass ways here, okay? Someone was toxic, okay? I don't like the ace of wands here with the tower, okay? Somebody's shit is on fire here, can you have an STD? Um, two of swords with the magician here, somebody's faking it. Okay, someone's being all they can be here, but it's just the package. Um, on the inside here, there's the Ace of Wands with the Tower. Okay, so you know somebody, someone has you know some type of attachments here. All right, King of Swords, Five of Swords, yeah. Mm -mm. Someone definitely has some type of attachments. I'm feeling here. You know, someone could, you know, be hoping and praying for another chance here, but I just feel like you cut um, the situation out here. Um, just cut them off here. No more celebration here. Okay. Emperor energy could be dealing with an Aries here. Someone could even feel like they're owed a second chance here or another chance. Or someone could feel like you owe them an apology here. Like, what the fuck is going on? Yeah, with the Two of Pentacles and the Two of Swords. Like, somebody got something real effed up. <laughs> okay? They're delirious here. Two of Pentacles with the Two of Swords energy. Mm hmm So, you know, behind closed doors, someone is a bit of a nutcase here. All right? I'm just feeling the energy of, yeah. 
bit of a nutcase here, all right? Not doing so well. Someone's a mess, absolute mess here. Okay, there is a lot of divine guidance in this situation, thank God. Okay, temperance energy. Could be dealing with a Sagittarius. So, yeah, Queen of Swords with the Chariot. You're moving forward here. Okay, Ace of Swords. I feel like you don't need anything else from this person here. Um, you also have received all the clarity you need in a situation to move forward here. Um, you've made your, you stated your case here. Um, you've made your intentions clear to move forward here. Okay, I'm just feeling like a clean cut has been made here. Yeah, magician energy tied to the queen of wands as well. Okay, yeah, justice with the two of wands. Interesting. Mm -hmm. You know, could be dealing with the um, an Aries or a Libra. But not feeling like you made the right decision here, okay, with the Justice card, because someone was playing a lot of games. There was a third party always hanging around and attached here. Okay, there was a toxic bond and attachment here. Yeah, there was a couple here. Mm -hmm. And they pop, um, possibly wanted you attached as well. Okay, I'm hearing goulash. Hot mess. We up with the Knight of Swords. Someone's talking a lot of shit here. Okay, there's a male fire sign perhaps or a play boy energy that you're dealing with here because someone's hurt as hell. Okay, yeah, the cycle has been closed and someone has been blocked. Cancer. Okay, just going to get a couple more to close uh, this energy on out here. Yeah, four of wands. Yeah, justice again. Okay, balance. Yeah, ten four. Ten of swords with the four of wands. Okay, complete clarity um, in regards to moving forward. All right, well, Cancer, that has been your reading. Thanks for watching my channel, Journey to Soul. Bye.